Righto. Oh, by the way, hope never fucking dies. That's Brenner's theme playing in the background, which is why it's so manly and metal. You die. Eat this. Yeah. Normally, the tank would be able to use its cannon against these recons, but it can't since it's out of ammo. You can have the infantry go to the space, although it's not required. Can you hear me? Hold on! Is she alive? Uh, I think so. Her breathing is really faint. Come on, we've got to get her back to camp! It ain't worth the trouble, kid. I doubt I she's long for this world. I'm not giving up. If you want help, I'll carry her myself. Are you serious? Hey, can you hear me? Can you sign, will you? That's it. I ain't sticking around to rescue a corpse. Open your eyes. I know there's not much to see, but you can't give up. You're alive, you know? And when there's life, there's hope. Uh, who, who are you? Yes! You heard me! You're alive! But please tell me, who are you? I'm Will. I'm with Brenner's Wolves. What's your name? I, I don't know. What do you mean? I don't remember. I don't remember anything. Okay, okay, don't worry. You've been through a lot. Everything's gonna be fine. Just come with me. Alright. Well, well, we found ourselves a hot chick. This can only mean good things. What's happening? Don't worry. You're safe. You're with the Rubinel army now. Rubinel? Rubinel is one of the two main countries on this continent. Yeah? At the last known date, the army employed 1,296,973 men. What? Okay. What the? How do you know that? Ruben and its neighbor have been war for a century. Despite several armistices, the fighting the fighting's never truly ended. And emulator froze. Fuck. Ten percent of Ruben GDP is expended on weaponry and research. The last recorded assessment of its military strength was excellent. Where did you learn that? I I don't know. I don't understand. Jeez. Yeah, okay. Let's talk about it later. Right now we have to get back to camp in one piece. Alright. Wherever this chick is, she's something. All units, study the terrain and use it to your advantage. Terrain effects. Use maps in for the sea features and defenses are offered by different terrain. The more stars in the age, the more protection it provides. Each star raises the defense each star raises the defense of that unit by one by one percent for each star for each for each star and for each hit point that a uh, unit has. So, for example, the tank is standing. Uh, the infantry, uh, blah, 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 blah. the artillery is standing in the forest. So it has. So it gives uh, three. So it basically gives three defense for each hit point it has. So right now it has 130 defense. 130 percent defense. I hope that made sense. Like ammo, f like ammo and food and everything in this world, fuel is scarce. Avoid unnecessary movement and keep an eye on your fu fuel gauge. Fuel. Though rare, it is possible for a unit to run out of fuel. Units can refuel at any friendly city or base. When a unit moves, they expend fuel. And when they run out of fuel, they can no longer move. This is only in the case of ground units. When it comes to air or naval units, they crash. Alright, I'll attack you. Law, you're dead. And now for you. Dead. Arr, not again! How did, the, how did those dirt balls survive? This ain't over, ladies. You ain't the last of the beast. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go suck it up. Best rank yet! Woot. Make sure the civilians are cared for. Hell yeah! You okay, Will? I'm fine, sir. But the girl we found... Who is she? I don't know. I found her unconscious near some ruined buildings. Good work bringing her in. Mm -hmm. What's your name, sweetie? Um, I don't know. You don't know? Listen, kid, I... Captain Brenner, let me explain. She lost her memory? Is that what you're saying? 
It's not surprising with all that's happened to this world. Sometimes I wish mine was gone too. There's more, sir. It seems the girl has detailed knowledge of our army. I would be interested to know where she obtained her information. Very interested, sir. Easy, Lynn. She's a survivor who needs our help, not an enemy combatant. Will saved her, and we're going to see that she gets some someplace safe. Clear? Sir. She's your responsibility now, Will. Stay with her. See that she's taken care of. Understood. Oh, wow. How about that? All right. You can press start to save the game, but the game saves all saves the state automatically every time you clear a map. Chapter three, Free Haven. At the music time, twelve battalion HQ. Okay, see this spot on the map? That's our next destination. It's a small village. A village with people? That's right. The earthquakes and tidal waves destroyed most of the cities, but in some places, survivors have begun banding together. This village is one such area. In the midst of anarchy and chaos, they've come together to reestablish laws and government. Laws? Why do they have laws? The world's been destroyed. There's no one left to help them enforce their laws. That's why they're, that's why they're doing it on their own. They need some way to create order. No one forced them to do it. It's just natural to try and prevent murder and other crimes. You see, Will? Even in the most unexpected places, humanity shows its inherent value. Permission to disagree, Captain? It's not proof of virtue. It's simply a survival strategy. A society that doesn't prevent punish murder is a society where anyone can be murdered. A society of sleepless nights, where people live in fear of everyone around them. When faced with that, it only makes sense to band together and agree to prohibit murder. People are motivated by their own interests. Their me the meteors didn't change that at all. They certainly didn't change you, did they, Lin? I see you still don't factor in human decency. As for you, Will, you and the girl will be safe, once we get you to the village. You're civilians, so they'll welcome you with open arms. I don't know, Brenner. Hold it right there! Identify yourselves! Don't try anything funny! We've got snipers watching you! My name's Brenner. I'm Captain of the 12th Battalion of the Rubinell Army. I need to talk to your mayor. Tell him I'm here. What? You with those raiders? Weren't you here to attack us? Yeah, I bet that's it! You came back to kill us all, didn't you? Listen, we don't want trouble. Your mayor owes me his life. Tell him my name and I'm sure he'll agree to see us. Come on, guys! He's help us out, will you? Hey, you're too young to be one of them raiders. Maybe you're okay after all. Wait here, we'll go get the mayor. About time. Word, Brenner. Mayor! At Freehaven. So it really, so it really is you. Your weapons and uniforms have my people scared out to death. What do you want, Brenner? We're trying to live in peace. We don't need your kind here. So it seems. Don't worry, we'll know as soon as we finish what we came here for. We rescued some civilians a few clicks back, including an injured girl. I want you to take them. I hope you're not marching in here and giving us orders. I truly don't. Things aren't that simple, friend. My village is barely getting by as it is. No one's giving orders. I'm asking you for your help. They're just a couple of kids. They're not going to make it out there alone. And that's not our fault. We didn't make this world, but we have to live in it. That's reality. Reality? The reality is that there's nothing out there but cockroaches and corpses. And corpses. These people survive. They're alive, and it's up to us to keep them that way. Maybe that was true before, but now? I don't think so. Millions and millions of people are dead. I don't think a couple more are such a tragedy. What a douche! The more people we have living here, the more mouths we have to feed. We can't afford it. Okay, you may, you got a point there. So you think they're not worth saving? That's not what I'm saying. We don't want to see anyone die, better. you know that. But you don't know what you're asking for. We simply don't have the means to take them in. I'm sorry. I see. You're soldiers. You can use your weapons to tell you, take what you need. All we want is to be left in peace. Now do us a favor and take your troubles elsewhere. You are the mayor. Hit the road. We don't need warmongers in our lives. You read me? I read you. Sorry, Will, but it looks like you're going to be traveling with us until we find another village. Don't worry, Captain. That's fine with... Head for cover! The raiders are back! Where's the mayor? The raiders? Are you sure? Oh, shit. Look at this, roaches. Soldier boys are visiting our village. This guy, is re this guy is relentless. Nothing like a nice day of rain, murder, and... Frozen emulator. And revenge. <laughs> of all the luck. Dear Mother of Mercy, look at those savages! You gotta help us, Brenner! They destroyed everything in the, every village in the region, now they come for us! All those innocent lives. They have tanks! We have sticks and rocks! Please, you have to help us! Alright, leave them to us. You get your people out of here. Start evacuating. In regards to payment, there's no time for that now. Get moving! Hope never fucking dies! Captain, we have only five units at our disposal while the enemy has nine! They enjoy significant advantages in firepower! 
Bullets don't win wars. Soldiers do. And I'm betting ours are smarter. Fucking love that line. Unit chart. Select mission info from the menu and choose chart to display all of your units. Use this chart to help plan your strategy. Alright, that's enough for this episode, so I'll see you later.